Hello, today I'm going to show you how to upgrade from Ubuntu 18.10 to Ubuntu 19.4 daily builds. This is the day when Ubuntu daily builds got live. So this is the first day Ubuntu 19.4 daily builds of course. So this is the first day you can download the daily builds ISO from Ubuntu 19.4 from the internet and install it and this is also the first day when you can upgrade to this development release for the development cycle option. So to celebrate this day we are going to show how to upgrade from Ubuntu 18.10 to Ubuntu 19.4 Disco Dingo and I've already done it today on my own system, but it's not recommended because things can go wrong. The, the only reason why I'm doing it is because I want to see what is the latest, what if something new big has happened. I want to see it and be one of the first and then also make a video of it. So I'm trying to be up to date for my channels basically and that is quite cool actually to see like every day a heap of updates coming out and you know you got the latest 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 what is out there but uh, as I normally say and it's true rather wait until like final beta states or beta states and then upgrade but it's completely up to you as you can see we just first run all the normal updates on the system and we, and we already copied this command you don't have to in the past you have to first like lock up your system the, the lock screen won't won't appear when you do your updates they made it much easier since the previous release when 18.10 became stable that it will disable the lock option in your system until the upgrade is done and also it will disable all third party app repos in your system so after you've done the installation, you have to enable them again, which I will show you how to do. I don't have any third party apps in this working machine, which we are looking at now, but I will show you how to do it after it also this morning and it worked just fine. So as you can see, the update is basically done. And depending on when you are upgrading, your system this will be this can take very long or it will take a few minutes like mine today because as time go by the past will become more and more new packages and more and more to upgrade and update and it can be at the end it will be like one point one gigabyte or more but at the moment it's like 60 megabytes so and I will just get updates as it's coming through so in this which we do today will work until the until Ubuntu 19.4 becomes stable in April next year. So this method will stay the same no matter what time you're doing it in the cycle and if you wait too long and you're already at 19.10 this will work exactly the same. So as you can see it's, it's gonna run or it's gonna run a while now, so I'm gonna fast forward until we have to do something again. I'll see you soon. So as you can see... Oh no. So we were too late, I was waiting too long to say yes, so it aborted. So if you're waiting too long for your system to... Before saying yes, they just abort your system. Sorry, I missed it. So... Let's try again. <laughs> so now you see what you do if you don't focus on what's happening. You have to press yes in a certain time otherwise so you can't go away and have a cup of coffee. You have to wait it through. <laughs> As you can see I'm making this video live and anything can happen and that's what I like about this channel. You will get a real, real deal and we will learn together. And you will also learn to love a beautiful South African accent with a bit of Russian also in it. Oh, yeah. 
So as you can see, we're doing the same process now. It's going to update the system and it's going to say we have to download 25 megabytes. Of course, it will, it can be much more when you do it because, as I said, today is the first day it can be out. So now let's be ready to press Y for yes. We want to upgrade. And press enter to continue. And now it will start to install, download all these packages and install them. So I will see you soon. Fantastic, so as you can see, we have already done the installation part and now we just wait for him to search for packages which he can remove. I'm going to start to close this document and as you can see, it's all, it's all done and if you press Y now and press enter, it will reboot the system. So I will see you after I press enter in a few seconds. Goodbye. Fantastic, so you can so as you can see, we have just put it up, of course, because I don't know what's going to happen in Ubuntu 90.4. I don't know what's going to change, if what is going to change, but as this is the first day, not much will be changed now. But we will be able to see in the settings that this is truly the coding go, which we are running now. And as time will go on, we will have more new features and... I can't wait to see what's going to happen. Yeah, so as we go to settings. And details, you will see Ubuntu Disco Dingo. Development commands. So yeah, this is basically it. We've done it and it was successful. And if you want to make backups, go for it. If not, and you're willing to take the risk, go for it also. Thank you for watching. See you later. Goodbye.